Hello, I thought I would share with you where we have been staying for the last week. We are in an Airbnb in Hastings and I thought I'd do a tour and then I'll also show you how near we are to the high street here in the old town in Hastings. Um, but yeah, first I'll show you around up here. It's an Airbnb, we will link it below because we can highly recommend it. We've loved staying here. Um, now it's got a bit of history to it as well. I have to remind myself, it was the Duke of Wellington's headquarters in 1806. I know, right? It's a uh, third floor, it's a top floor in a really old building. And yeah, I will flip the view and give you a bit of a tour around. And then we'll take a walk downstairs and I'll show you how near we are to the centre of the old town in Hastings. So if we start outside at the top of the stairs, with this beautiful chandelier. We come in this way, into a little hallway, and then this is the main sitting room. There's Andrea, hello. Mm -hmm. There's Jeffrey, hello. You sitting in the patch of sun? Yeah, good plan. So you can see how close we are to the sea. There's the beach just down there. This is the Old Town High Street that I'll show you once we've done the tour. So that end has lovely views across there. Sash windows, all the sash windows work. That's been really handy actually to have those open. So this is the sitting room area. We have an interesting coffee table arrangement. And then it has a kitchenette over here, which we've used a lot. It's a lovely vintage crockery. Vintage crockery. Yeah. I was excited when I saw all this. In there. Everything you would expect. And Edinburgh crystal glasses. Lovely. So that's the little kitchenette area. And if we come through, there's a small but well-equipped little bathroom and toilet with a walk-in shower. In there. And then that's where the front door is. And then through to the one bedroom, it's a one bedroom apartment, has a huge king size bed, rather grand. This very cool little vintage wardrobe thing, which we've been using. Little dresser over there. And then we have a roll top bath in the corner. <laughs> there we go. Another little chest of drawers over there. One of these, what would you call that? Is that a chaise long? I'm not sure. And a great big sash window. Again, this, this sash window opens. It does have a lock on it, but you can open it fully. And you can see the view, oops. You can see the view down to the Old Town High Street and this lovely mural on the side of that building. And again, there's the sea. That's how close we are to the sea. So there you have it. Come back through to here. And despite it being right in the centre of the old town, it's actually relatively quiet, isn't it? Because we're up so high, I guess. It is, yeah. Yeah. Jeff's had a few brumbles, but we haven't had lots of barking. Jeff, Jeff's heard some dogs barking down on the street, haven't you? But Only apart if from the window open, he can hear that. Yeah. So that's where we've been staying for the last week. Um, there's an antique store below, and a lot of these items are part of that business if you like so they are actually priced up these lamps are 195 pounds if you would like to take them home for example which has been interesting there's also a working 
record player here. So that's rather amazing. I've got a brake you can use here to stop it. So as I was saying, one of the best things about this place is the location. If you want to be right in the heart of the old town here in Hastings, you can't really beat this location. Um, so what we'll do in a sec is we'll go down the stairs. That's the other thing I was gonna mention. If you do come and stay here, be prepared to be on the top floor and have to come up three flights of stairs. We'll go down in a minute and I'll show you. So that's one thing to bear in mind. So what we'll do now is we'll go down, I'll show you the, the little alleyway we come out into, which is really cool. And then the, the antique shop that we're above, and we'll show you how close we are to not only the High Street, but St George's Street, which is the kind of center of everything in the old town. And then the beach, which is just over there. You ready? I think so. Yeah, we are checking out right now. So this is our last goodbye to the, yes. to the apartment. I was just gonna say that those stairs, Jeff was not impressed in the beginning, was he? He didn't want to come up them but oh, a week on, he's, he's, he's flying up there. We've got used to it now. Are we gonna show how well you can go down the stairs? Yes, Dad, sure, yes, Dad. Let's get going, he says. <laughs> yes. Right, let's go. <laughs> There's that chandelier I was talking about before, which also has a price tag. £995. Right, so now we are ground floor. So that's where we came out of. And then the apartment is above this antique shop. There's the mural that you saw from the window. And then a short stroll down here. Brings you to George Street, down this way. Quickly show you this while I'm here. There's Jeff and Andrew. And if 
we go down we can cut through to the beach can't we so there's a pub down here that we can recommend as well This is the old pump house. Absolutely gorgeous building. So the apartment is just in there, somewhere. <laughs> and here we are, a couple of minutes walk from the door and we are on the beach. So that way is the new town and over here is the old town. And down here is all the famous fishermen's huts and all the fishing boats. And this way is the sea. So we are about to head home now. Andrea's just getting ready with Jeff out there. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, we will link the Airbnb below. So if you are coming down this way and you're looking for a place to stay, we can't recommend it enough. Just be aware there's three flights of stairs to go up to get to the door. Um, thank you very much for watching. Take care. I'll see you soon. Bye.